No worries. This is a word in Kiswahili. Hakuna matata. No worry. No worries. This is one phrase I cannot forget after my visit to East Africa. And you can see it on this t-shirt. One of the souvenirs from East Africa. Jesus repeats these words at the Last Supper with his disciples. He told them that he was going to leave that he was going to prepare a place for them in heaven and that they should have no worries about his absence. In the gospel, Jesus is saying that do not let your hearts be troubled. Have faith in me. He reminds us that what is most important in life is that we should come and follow him because he is the way, he is the truth, and he is the life. Jesus calmed the fears of his apostles regarding the future. It is assured since they have a room prepared already for them in his father's house. If they believe in Jesus, they will not get lost on their way to the father, nor will they feel being a stranger before him when the time comes. They who have seen, heard, and touched the Lord already will have the same intimacy with the Father because the Father has an intimate relationship with the Son. From time to time, we all experience fears. We all experience worries. We all experience anxieties. At times, they are too strong that they even affect our sleep and even our appetite. And because we are prone to fear, anxiety, and worry, uh, the, the Bible seems to just tell us clearly, in, in clear terms, several hundred times that we should not worry. But why does the Bible keep on telling us this? Because our faith is weak. And instead of looking at God or looking unto God, very often we look unto our problems. But Jesus tells us today, Hakuna Matata, no worries. Among the remedies of worries, I can talk of one that is called the sacrament of the present moment by some great spiritual writers. So it means that we should live the present moment because that is the reality at the time. Each moment is a sacrament. Each moment is a visible sign instilled to us in the concrete circumstances in which we find ourselves. Every moment of our life comes with Christ and it brings with it grace. And this is the important point. It brings with it grace, not for yesterday, not for tomorrow, but for this present moment to help us plan for the future. Many breakdowns come as a result of the fact that we try to carry the loads of yesterday on us and also tomorrow's load. Today is a time for grace, and Jesus keeps on telling us, do not worry. When we are with the Lord Jesus Christ, my dear brothers and sisters, we cannot worry because he is always there for us. He is the way, he is the truth, and he is the life. He tells us that we should bring all our burdens to him and we'll make them lighter. Are you worried because of sickness? Are you worried because of disappointments? Are you worried because of failure? Are you worried because, because, because you can keep on adding the litany of worries? But Jesus tells us something, which I'm going to repeat to us. Hakuna Matata. Do not worry. My Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah, ah, Hallelujah, ah, Hallelujah.
Alléluia, Alléluia. 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 